probably 10 years ago, I had a friend of a friend reach out to me and tell me that he has something life-changing. Hey, we have this product called Extreme Endurance and it buffers lactic acid. I feel like I started to feel different after a couple of days for sure. It takes a lot for me to believe in something. I need to see changes on paper with times. On paper, my times were faster. My immediate thought was this stuff can't be legal, right? I took it leading up to one of my bigger indoor track races, ran closest to my PR than I had in a long time. I'd say it's one of the few things that I actually take every single day. So I take extreme endurance every single day. Every 12 hours, three pills in the morning and three at night. Three pills in the morning and three pills at night. So I'm really taking like seven a day. Three tablets in the morning and three tablets in the late afternoon. I think everybody's body reacts differently. I think everybody's mindset is different. Everybody works out differently. And so I need more of the product or less of the product. A day after lifting, I wasn't as sore the next day. So I was able to push it a little harder each day. I think extreme endurance brings consistency with my work. So it brings consistency with how I feel during sessions, during long runs. I was smashing this workout. If I had someone tell me they didn't feel the benefits of extreme endurance, I would tell them to check all of the boxes outside of extreme endurance as well. Extreme endurance is not a magic pill. So you still want to get sleep. You still want to recover. You still got to look at your nutrition. You have to take recovery days. This next week, don't take it at all. See how you feel. And that is always always the thing that gets everyone. A lot of athletes are concerned about uh, clean products. They spend more money to not cut corners. If you're taking extreme endurance, rest assured, you're not gonna test positive for a banned substance. There's a lot of supplement companies out there who don't use informed sport, but I would never use a product if the informed sport badge was not on the bag. I'm no longer a sponsored athlete. I haven't been for a few years because I retired and I still take it. I still purchase extreme endurance and I take it because I like the way that I feel. And I believe it's for every single human out there. It lowers oxidative stress and inflammation. That's huge for athletes, but that's also huge for the general public. I truly love X endurance and I love what it does for my body.